we'll get there four or five hours before the game um, and, and make sure that the arena is set properly, chairs, tables, uh, the lobby, staffing, uh, the hoops are the way they're supposed to be, visiting team preparations, their locker room, the officials' locker room, the whole deal. You know, just make sure all that stuff is done uh, well in advance uh, for the teams and officials to show up a couple hours before the game. Those guys are the structure to everything. You know, we, we get to have all the fun. Those guys are making sure everything goes well from, you know, parking to, you know, TV truck getting set up. Um, you know, they do a great job of just making sure everything runs on time and uh, that really, you know, the whole game flow in the event just um, goes as scheduled. They have to work with the outside media. They have to work with um, inside staff. Uh, making sure every single little inch of that building is taken care of, is ready for the game. John Whifford, he embodies UCF and, and everything that it means to be a knight. He does more than just what a normal equipment guy will do. You know, he's out there may, helping keep the court clean for us and making sure the basketballs are all at the right PSI. You know, people don't think about that stuff. Just in terms of making sure the players have what they need, um, you know, to go out there and perform, do what they need to do. We work a lot with him to make sure that, you know, because sometimes there's equipment that we need or things that we need to do during the game, and we want to make sure that anything that we're doing is not impeding what he's doing. My role particularly is to make sure they have the uniforms and the warm-up shirts for the game itself. My staff is to make sure everything behind the scenes gets done. If it is giving water, towels, if athletic trainers are busy, we, we'll help with water. We do towels. Um, shooting shirts are taken and put aside until halftime or after the game. Can't thank John enough. Uh, just a great guy and a great guy to work with. Corey's one of those guys who are there way before, hours and hours before the game starts. Getting set up, make sure he's ready to go for the game. Um, you know, the, those stats, every, all the information that comes through during the game, that he's making sure he's getting those stats and information out to the coaches during quarter breaks, halftime, end of the game, making sure that he's setting up those post-game interviews and making sure that people who need to be in those interviews are getting to those interviews. Um, he does an absolutely fantastic job. Most of my primary role on the game day is to uh, deal with the media and getting them situated, whether it's TV or radio or print media that comes to cover ours from you know, our local media, um, the Orlando Sentinel, to uh, even the visiting teams and getting them situated their seats. He does a great job updating our fans on social media during the game, getting the statistical information to all of press row, making sure all the press has the information they need, their notes and, and whatnot uh, for the game that day. The look of the arena, that's, that's on marketing. You know, when you walk in and you, you hear, you know, people don't notice it, but you hear the fight song playing in the lobby when you come in, or you see the, the nitro statue or the blow up out there, you see, the, you know, all those different aspects that visually make the arena appealing and visually making you want to come back, that's marketing doing all of that hard work. I work very closely with our sponsorship team and we plan all of the timeouts, half times, we work closely with our ticket sales to do more half time um, experiences, uh, dance experiences, national anthem experiences. Whether it's making graphics, making billboards, um, helping with the script, whatever the case may be. Um, and once we get to the game day itself, just making sure that plan that we have set and that she has, has set is executed. Um, and making sure that not only myself, but also the interns who are working with marketing um, execute that plan. I work very closely with our video department. Um, I create a script and then I go over it with the video department for every game. Um, I sit next to David, whoever sees the production of the game. I work closely with marketing to help with the technical aspect of the game. I am in constant communication with our director, making sure we're ready for the next video that needs to be played or slide that needs to be shown on the video board. They're constantly cutting cameras during the show, um, queuing up replays, and hopefully giving a awesome show for our, our fans. I see the hours that, that are you know put in from the video department, but man, it's uh, the final product is always first class.